white male pulled a gun on, a, uh, on another couple and then fled the scene. And this is a theater thread. A night at the movies ends with a scary encounter. Good evening. I'm Dave Sess. And I'm Erica Thomas. We got tipped off to this story from the Niles Police Facebook page today. Today we got a hold of the 911 calls for help and learned that the gun pulled out was a fake. 27 First News reporter Nadine Grimley has those new details in tonight's top story. A terrifying scene unfolding in Niles following a late night show. An argument spilling into the parking lot after the final credits finished rolling. Stupid things escalate into serious uh, situations like this. It all started here at the Regal Cinemas in Niles over an argument about talking during the movie. 911, what's your emergency? Yeah, there's a guy with a gun outside of the Regal movie theater. He got in his car and now he's driving back across the movie theater. I don't know who to talk to about this, but uh, I don't want him shooting anybody. He already pulled it on me and my dog family. The victim on the phone with 911 as he was following the suspect, now identified by police as 23-year-old Vincent Dundorf, until authorities could arrive. The cop is right behind me and the car is right in front of me. Officers pulled over Dundorf's car and found this airsoft gun with the safety markings removed from it inside. Dundorf was taken into custody and is now facing an aggravated menacing charge. It's a stupid thing to do because, first of all, he could have pulled it on a police officer that was off duty or somebody that had a concealed carry permit. And you don't have time to wait and examine a gun when someone pulls on it. You react and you shoot. Back at the movie theater, the corporate owner says they consider the safety of their guests and staff a priority, telling First News they're cooperating with the local police department regarding the investigation. In Niles, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News.